In this video, I will explain the method to extract the fluid volume. Uh, the example here I'm, I'm going to uh, be applying the method is the mixing tank. And the geometry I got from the GrabCAD, so this geometry is not uh, made by, by me or I don't know uh, the specifications or the, even the problems of the geometry. So first, let me show you the geometry from the inside. So if I hide this part, which is on the top, it's a lid on the top, so let's hide. We can see that uh, there are two impellers on the, one is on the top side, one is on the bottom side and uh, then the design is like this and maybe there is a uh, some hole uh, on the bottom and there's some gap here maybe some other fluid maybe is here maybe air is is going from this side and, and entering from the bottom i don't know uh, but the right now what is uh, the main theme is that we have to uh, extract the fluid volumes so we are going to make the uh, three domains the two domains for two impellers and uh, those two domains will be rotating and when uh, the one domain that is the remaining volume of the tank that is uh, without the these impeller volumes around them so let's start so the final uh, uh, final geometry we are going to get is looks like in this way exactly this one this is what we are going to create okay so the first thing is that we have to look for the problems in the geometry uh, let me show you one thing. Let's say if I create a one plane and this video is going to be very long. So please be with me and but definitely you are going to get a lot of knowledge here. So first thing that I am going to do is that I am going to split this uh, volume into two parts to just show you that uh, what we are getting there. Okay. So now I will be hiding only half part. And you can notice this thing that uh, this tank has the interference between this part and this part. So now definitely the fluid cannot be here, which is solid body. So it means that tank should be of smaller height or maybe this lid was uh, maybe made very larger. So I don't know this thing, uh, but I assume that the tank should be at this level. Okay. So it should be at this level, which is uh, over here. So that's why I'm going to split this tank, this part by this and then remove the extra part from here. Uh, secondly is that second part of the lid we can delete. We will keep the shaft and also the outside of the, this uh, tank will be deleted. So we are now left with the, uh, this is the thickness of the geometry. So you can see here that uh, now you cannot see the hole uh, in the, uh, the the tank so now let's uh, make this geometry opaque you can delete these two planes three planes and the bottom is there or not let's see it Okay, there's no uh, bottom surface in this case. So let's uh, create these two surfaces by ourselves. So I'm going to create the two surfaces on the top and on the bottom so that we can create by the fill command or by uh, the blend command. This is not making the surface here. So let's use the uh, so let's use the fill command. So we got the one face here and one face we require over here. But second method that I want to tell you is that before uh, we go with the faces, uh, let me show you one more method. So we want to get the volume, right? So I will go to the prepare menu and uh, the volume extra. Volume extra is used for uh, getting the fluid, uh, fluid domain for the internal flow. And the enclosure is to create the fluid domain around the body. So definitely this is going to be the uh, fluid extract. So I'm going to uh, use these two surfaces. I will try this thing first. And they are basically the ending surfaces of the geometry. And where I want the volume, I want the volume here. So let's try this technique. So let me show you this thing. 
and now you have to hide this geometry the outside and see did we get the proper volume or not and also hide other things like here uh, the only issue that I am seeing here is that we have the like the hole for the shaft okay so now let's uh, click on the section plane so we have the these uh, geometrical holes here okay so what is idea here is that idea is that we are trying to fill these uh, holes by the fill command let's try one by one okay so i am going to select these uh, four edges okay uh, it didn't remove the uh, there's those geometrical parts so let's try in the full mode so select the whole thing yes this thing and uh, this one and also the bottom one okay so we have removed the uh, the imperfections in the tank volume so now we work on other parts before that right click on the geometry here geometry tree outline and uh, delete empty components okay this will be a very simple procedure and uh, now let's display the other parts so this part is still here which we because we hidden the part so this part is still there so this part we have to delete and this part we have to delete okay and now this make make this tank as uh, transparent by clicking over here so now we have the uh, these two impellers with us but these impellers i i have seen these impellers and they have some issues so first of first of all you have to save the project file after working for this much amount of the effort so let's put the name as the mixing tank two okay okay so uh, up till now because this is going to be long video so i'm going to make them in the part so i will be stopping here and uh, then i will start working on the impellers in the next video